Good morning, and it is a great honor to attend the International Conference on Cardiology and Cardiovascular Medicine. My name is Jinghui Wang from Anhui University of Chinese Medicine, China. And the topic I reporting today is artificial intelligence and medical big and data analysis. With the development of the computers, artificial intelligence had also made breakthrough progress and it has also been integrated into various disciplines which has promoted the development of various disciplines and led the start of the interdisciplinary in the future. And while um, two land events, the first big uh, Google's ever fraud, the first uh, to predict the three dimension structure of all proteins in the human body. Lend to phase the development in drug screen and disease, and force the development of experimental methods such as uh, cryo electron microscopy and X ray direction to obtain protein structure. The second is about ChatGPT. The emergency of ChatGPT will greatly promote the development of medicine. Artificial artificial intelligence mainly include mainly include uh, supervised learning uh, and unsupervised learning. Supervised learning mainly includes regression and classification. Unsupervised learning mainly includes uh, dimensionality, reduction, and clustering. One of the important methods in signal theory sequence analysis is uh, dimensionality. Reduction. This is an AI-based drug vision, visual screen progress. There are many kinds of uh, there are many kinds of visual screen software are based on the Austrian AI, such as open software, outdoor, and commercial software goals. And the content we report today is mainly divided into three parts. The first is AI and CIDD. The second is AI and herbal medicine and its formulations. The second, the third is AI um, and multi omicus. We first introduce the first pass. As we all know, the cycle of drug development is quite long, and the possibility of success is quite low. Uh, through artificial intelligence methods such as uh, computer aid drug design, uh, the cycle of drug development can be greatly reduced. Computer aid drug design development is mainly divided into three part, two parts. One is indirect direct drug design based on um, ligand ligand <coughs> strategy based. One is, uh, and the other is uh, directed drug disease based receptor. The three dimension, uh, three dimension quantitative structure activity relationship refers to the uh, quantitative study of the interaction between small organic molecules and the biological micromolecules by means of mathematical and statistical methods with the help of the physician and the chemical properties or structure parameters of the molecules. The three dimensions, <coughs> the mathematical models of molecular three dimension structure information and the biological activity is established and the mathematical model is used to predict the activity of drugs. Molecular dynamics is mainly rely on Newton Mechanics to simulate the motion of molecular system according to the protection emerger energy function, the force acting on each atom is obtained. And the configuration integral of the system is calculated based on the results of the configuration integral. 
the thermodynamic uh, quantities and other microscopic properties of the system are further calculated. Molecular dynamics can dynamically observe the binding press, the binding press, the binding press of the drug and the targets. The binding free <coughs> energy is the thermodynamic property when the drug target interaction reaches equilibrium in a specific thermodynamic progress process, the system can output useful energy to accurately reflect the affinity between the two. We first use the homology modeling method to construct the three-dimensional structure of the receptor. receptor. Uh, and then construct a mathematical model based on the ligand and receptor respectively. We solve the three we solve three problems. The first is the structure activity relationship. Then, then the binding model of the drug and the target, and finally we examine examined the binding mechanism of the drug and the target. Segmentation of the of large data set is the key is a key step in constructing mathematical models. This is difficult to construct a reasonable model for large data sets. Therefore, we did a reasonable data set segmentation algorithm based on genetic algorithm. And the main idea of the algorithm is that the chemical substance in the training set must be structurally diversified to convert the entire space of the data set. Secondly, the data points in the training sets are closer to the data points in the validation sets and then and the molecular activity of the validation is entirely is evenly distributed throughout the data sets activity range. Here we introduce the second part. Plant, plant medical medicines contain hundreds of chemical molecules. But which are effective? And how do effective molecules interact? It is really um, effective. How effective it is? These problems, these problems have always hindered the development of the plant medicine. Drug into the body and works on multiple levels. Can it into the um, human body, reach the target? Can uh, there be impact the on specific pathways and the networks? And ultimately, how overall these problems are difficult to solve experimentally. Therefore, we built a visual human system based on artificial intelligence methods to build a database to obtain medicines to reveal the relationship between ingredients and analysis the logic structure. We built an ADME screen system mainly based on some important parameters such as oral availability, drug likelihood, blood-brain barrier, and so on. This is the this is the target prediction technology we built. It doesn't require the three dimension structure of the receptor, but only the primary sequence information of the protein. The characteristic fragments of the like and the binding ranging are extracted extracted through artificial intelligence technology, which can predict most uh, all proteins in the human body. Network pharmacology is a popular popular method to study um, plant medicine in recent years. It, it pres presents the interaction between complex biological systems in the form of network 
constructs a network analysis model and reveals this essential biological system by analyzing its relationship and the characteristic of each component in the network. In this paper, we first obtained a new plant medicine compounds by static statical method, which composed of uh, composed of standard herbs. Then we constructed a multi-level network of drug target disease pathway and revealed the essential char characteristic of multi-component and multi-target synergistic treatments of complex diseases in the network pharmacology. After the publication of this paper, mass medicine also give a high evolution in their think. It provides it provides a new potential way for modern medicine to treat complex disease. This paper this paper combines the drug IDMA screen and drug targeting and network pharmacology rich in new in innovative system pharmacology method to exploit the multi scale mechanism of plant drug monomer compounds to effectively reduce diabetic diabetic nephropathy it was verified by in vitro and in vivo experiments, which provides a, provided a good research example for the study of the mechanism of plant medicine monomer compounds. In this paper, we use artificial intelligence and deep learning algorithms for the first time and coming in vitro and in vivo experiments to analysis the mechanism of classical herbal compounds pres prescription um, formula herbal formula first the active ingredients was uh, was screened screened by support vector machine and the random forest and then and the screen model was constructed secondly we predict the practice conduct the a multi Secure a multi secure network and analysis the network from the perspective of network from a dynamics from dynamics we explain the mechanism mechanism of action of the herbal medicine we use the we then use the pers perspective of deep learning algorithm to explain the drug drug interaction for the perspective of drugs. We also use the WGCNA algorithm to analyze the transcriptome to obtain some key genes from the perspective of genes. The mechanism of herbal medicine was again the elaborated. This is the paper we published. Uh, here we introduced the three parts. With the development of computers, it has also spawned the development of multiple or multi omicus artificial intelligence algorithms can mine new data features and result from massive multi omicus today attached by continuously optimizing me. Optimism and in entry specific pattern algorithms and realize the production prediction of a new dish. At present, the classical research including signal cell transcriptome analysis and and a single cell uh, spatial trans uh, trans trans transcriptome analysis analysis methods include. Uh, Dimensionality reduction and the clustering of single cell groups, and the notion of function types of single cells, cell trajectory research, and cell communication re research.
This is a progress based on um, multi amicus analysis methods. Many include uh, differential expression, prognosis, clinical, tumor micro environment, immunity, immune, immune infiltration, drug sensitivity. We combined, we combined with GU and TCA database. For multi amico analysis, in this figure, we mainly analyze the uh, differences and the prognosis of genes. We found that two genes are very sensitive, so we construct, can conduct a in deep analysis of these two genes. We perform the clinical staging and the univariate and the multivariate regression analysis of these two genes and found that the uh, prognosis of these two genes is very good. And these two genes were analysis for micro environment, immune cell infiltration, and the immune, Im, and the Im, immune checkpoints. Finally, these two genes may be potential biomarker for the treatment of cancer. Finally, the above, this is my <coughs> published paper. Uh, finally, this uh, the above is my contact information. I hope to have the opportunity to cooperate with experts in the future. Thank you very much.